YouTube, this is Anthony from the planet back for one last video tonight. This is going to be a comparison video for those that were wanting from the previous video. Um, you can actually just check that out. We'll probably throw up a link somewhere on this video. Uh, anyway, uh, in the last video I mentioned that there's a slight difference between the hobby boxes and the what uh, can be considered, I guess, retail or tournament packs. Uh, Hobby boxes are basically booster boxes that will have the uh, has code for trading card game online on the box and the individual packs in it. Uh, whereas the uh, non-hobby boxes and packs will not. Uh, those come in from the tournament prizes, the pre-release, um, the new legends tins, the Victini box sets. The poster packs, no, not poster pack. Um, what was it called? The album collector's album album box, and I'm assuming they come in the blister packs as well. Um, and here's a comparison on the left of for each of these cards. We have the hobby version. On the right, we have the tournament and. I guess other packaging versions. Uh, for those of you uh, who are wondering what that is in the background, a friend of mine is playing Pokemon. Uh, what version? Well, I, I can't see. So, Pokemon something, uh, black or white, on his uh, DSi XL for uh, some background music. Hopefully, it's not drowning me out. Um, he's actually borrowing the game from me. So. Uh, since I bought too many copies. Anyway, that's a totally other story. <laughs> All right, so to start off, here's the Pikachu, the uh, ultra rare, uh, formerly known as a secret rare, or what some people call a secret rare. Uh, right off the bat, you can kind of see a difference. Man, those attacks are loud. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so you can see the lightning symbol on the right one, and not so much on the left one. Left one. If I move it around, you can kind of see it, but it's more pronounced on the right version. Um, if we go in closer, I, I don't know if that does any good. Cause I, I can't tell if it's actually focusing, but uh, there's actually some texture. It isn't a sleeve, so there's going to be some reflections off the sleeve. But you can kind of see that it looks a, a little rough. And then over here, you can kind of see the finer... Uh, texture so coarse and fine. Uh, same with the background around the Pikachu. Uh, you can kind of see the bumps on the one on the right whereas on the ones on the left it, it looks very fine. You can hardly make it out on the video. Right? Um, other than that these cards are virtually identical. Um, the uh, energy symbol, the word basic, all the are foil and, and so is the rarity and the set symbol I should say add. Now here's something, the Reshiram, you can hardly tell them apart. Um, you have to actually look at them for the coarseness to be able to tell which version you have. The uh, coarseness uh, would appear in the uh, background, the white background around Reshiram. Uh, it does not appear on the border or the Pokemon itself. And you can see that this Reshiram, which is the uh, tournament version slash blister, tin, what have you, um, is a lot uh, more noticeable at certain angles and if I keep them next to each other you can kind of tell the difference. Now the biggest difference is actually on Zekrom. Now straight away you can easily tell there's a big difference in the background. The uh, tournament version, we'll just call it tournament version for, for the purposes of this video, uh, Pretty much the background looks very black, whereas the uh, hobby version, the background looks gray, almost white. Now, it still has the dif uh, same difference in between the fine texture and the uh, coarseness, which you can kind of see at certain angles. And yeah, this is just basically a comparison video for uh, these different things. Uh, for those that were wondering, uh, why we have uh, just a uh, recent abundance of Pokemon videos uh, while we've done a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! and uh, a couple of Magic videos. Uh, we're actually going to be putting up uh, more stuff on our shop, online shop, which you can find a, a link to in the description and on our channel. 
uh, for Pokemon cards, we're going to be starting with the black and white set and moving backwards. We do have some sets already up there, but they've, um, they've been kind of outdated. Uh, so once again, we're going to get the black and white set up uh, shortly and work our way backwards all the way to base set. So we're going to actually have the entire history of the Pokemon trading card game up on our uh, shop. And we're actually going to be running more tournaments in our shop as well. Um, so, yeah, it's going to be an exciting year of change for us. So here's uh, one last look at the Pikachus. <laughs> One last look at the restaurants. And one last look at the Zekroms, which is the easiest to tell of the two. And hopefully this answers uh, some of your questions on the, uh, if you were wondering, the difference between the cards that come in the two different types of packs. Uh, hopefully this answers those questions. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comments below. Uh, feel free to... Uh, give this a thumbs up if you like this or if you found this informative. Um, yeah, uh, we'll hopefully post more videos like this in the future. Uh, thank you for watching. This is Anthony of the Planet signing off once again.